Some might fear the future, but if you're an entrepreneur, you should embrace it. On January 1, 2015, the Philippines will be folded into the Association of Southeast Asian Nations Economic Bloc. We view this as not just a threat, but as a competitive challenge. It's really hard to invest in equipment right now. Technology changes really fast. You buy it today, by tomorrow, it's obsolete. Natural disasters occur more frequently, and in the future, will be more frequent with higher intensity. We should all be prepared, including our businesses. Our products are mostly targeted for kids, and most of the kids right now are digital natives. We will be extinct if we don't stay relevant and transform our company. But the good thing about the future is that you can still change it, unlike the past. What we Filipino SMEs need to do is to transform now. It's critical for the Pinoy SME to transform now. Imagine, 99.6% of the firms registered here in the Philippines are SMEs. As a whole, we contribute 32% of the GDP, and we provide 70% of the livelihoods of the Philippine population. The Pinoy SME has to adapt. We also have to keep up with technology. We should know how to stay relevant to them. The window for innovation, the time that you have to innovate, is going shorter and shorter. To aid us in our transformation, PLDT SME Nation showed us solutions like the use of managed services. The PLDT Cloud allows us to scale massively and we created a cloud service for government. And this is what is now inside the PLDT data center called Vitro. iKit is uh, very important because it's a dedicated line with a high bandwidth. We're able to send messages, even drawings, and through the warehouse, the invoicing and the scanning of things. So it's very important that you have also the fast link. The web presence in our company is so important because we're able to optimize our operations because even if we're closed at night, we're still visible to our potential customers and clients 24-7. So the technology like the cloud uh, video monitoring systems are instruments that we definitely need to make sure that we are ahead of the game. It's used to guide the efficiency of medical control in the back of our ambulances. So we can see from my home or from where I'm playing, I can actually log in and see what's going on in the office you know, during emergency situations, and so can all my managers. And one of the better decisions is the PLDT SME Nation's asset tracker. We installed it in our delivery trucks and we track them as they make their routes. We learned to optimize our routes, therefore we were able to save on gas and time. And because we know the routes of the trucks, unfortunate incidents involving the drivers are lessened. I think for any businessman, you want to be on top of the situation. We have to step it up, you know, and that's the reason why we tied up with the LDPS simulation. Because the moment we start to close our minds, that is when we stagnate. That's my thinking. So I'm not afraid of the future because I want to reinvent it. PLDT's profile has changed rapidly. From technology of copper lines to now wireless. When I started dealing with it three years ago, it was still a very like sleepy landline broadband-based company. But now it's completely different. It offers technology services. It's scaling rapidly to help a lot, not just the top enterprises, but small and medium enterprise. And the, the scale of its own transformation is quite astounding. The best part is to find somebody who can carry us for the future. And that, we believe, is PLDT SME Nation. If you're ready with the right tools, you shouldn't fear the future. For the future is yours for the taking. All we have to do is transform, transform now with PLDT SME Nation.